The Animax project is going to be first of its kind in Canada. Um, the city of Guelph is uh, pleased to be in the forefront of innovative technologies. Um, by introducing Animox process in our um, treatment, basically we are going to reduce the energy consumption by about 60%. The process uses the Animox bacteria to decrease the ammonia load in the side stream from the dewatering process at the plant. It's a two-step process that happens in the sequencing batch reactors. The ammonia is first reduced to nitrite and then converted to nitrogen gas. And that's all done using much less energy than in a conventional wastewater treatment plant. What we've done is developed a patent pending application to the way we measure water pressure in water distribution systems. What happens here is the original operating rod in these hydrants, like this, has been replaced with a new design lower rod that encapsulates the data loggers and pressure sensors. It gets us more pressure information from a distribution system. We can leverage that to get to know our system better and help us define leaks quicker and run our system more efficiently. And by using that data, we can add it also to our hydraulic model. So we, we know how our system will behave in, in different circumstances. One of the goals of the project is to share the technology and share the developments with others, and also to form partnerships. So on this project, we've been fortunate enough to be able to work with uh, three municipal partners, Guelph being the primary partner. Well, what we learn here helps other municipalities, but what we're also finding is that by supporting these technologies and demonstrating them, we're helping our economic development strategy as well. So it's attracting investment and job and new innovation into our community, into our region, and so that's helpful for the province that's also trying to establish itself internationally as a centre of excellence for water technology and expertise. Through initiatives such as the Showcasing Water Innovation Program or WaterTap, we work to build a network and an, and an expectation of collaboration once again. So with that in mind, we have pri the private sector at the table, we have academia at the table, we have municipalities and other levels of government at the table. This network, once again, you know, possesses that expertise not only to address our water challenges, um, but as well you know, create further expertise and products that can be you know, delivered throughout Ontario, Canada and worldwide. I think that network as well has a lot of you know, appeal in, in looking to other areas that are facing water challenges and see that there is a firm structure in place, uh, a healthy working relationship and you know, products of said collaboration.